they ran out of paper bags, so they gave me these crusty things. Bye. 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 Hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel. It is time. I'm really excited today to bring this to you. I just came back from Trader Joe's. I thought that, you know, it's October, it's fall, seasonal stuff. I wanted to check out what they had as well as share with you guys some of my favorite go-to items from Trader Joe's. I've talked about them in other videos in the past, but this is gonna be more in depth and in detail. I picked up these pumpkin biscotti cookies because pumpkin spice everything. I know Yannick likes biscotti cookies, so I wanted to give this a whirl and it was seasonal. Pumpkin spice, everything nice. And another thing that I got was pumpkin. This is actually for me because I really like these batons. I guess that's what they're, they're called. I don't, I, I didn't think that they were called batons, but okay. Pumpkin spice. Haven't tried them yet, but they're probably delicious. Could you imagine some hot cocoa and then some of these pumpkin spice little wafer things? Oh, oh. Keeping with the baked good treats, I've got the triple ginger snaps. These are Yannick and I's favorite. Favorite snack, favorite cookie snack. I'm not a huge fan of baked goods, but I like these a lot. They're very fresh. It's like, a gingerbread cookie on steroids. This is another dessert that I love from Trader Joe's. This is the hand dip cone. So delicious, great treat to have, and they're so tiny. Like you can treat yourself without overindulging, if you know what I mean. Another favorite dessert is the French macaroons that they have. I usually will get the assortment of the different flavors, but I love chocolate and I love vanilla. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the rest of the freezer items so that I can put those in the freezer so that they don't melt. So I absolutely love the Trader Joe's vegetable fried rice. This stuff is incredible. Literally takes like five minutes to cook. I put it with olive oil in a pan, cook it up, done. And then I like to pair it with their um, They have the barbecue chicken teriyaki, which is super good with the rice. Sometimes I'll use white rice for this, but usually when I'm cooking like this, it's my cheat meal, so I'm gonna do fried rice. So I'll do a fried rice and then the barbecue chicken teriyaki, have like a salad on the side, and bam, you got a whole meal. It feels like you're eating out, but you're eating in. It's really, really good. You guys have to try it if you haven't already. And then I've got the orange chicken. This is really good too. This I can pop in the oven. It's done really quick, really simple, easy meals. And then pair it with the fried rice and again like a little salad or some broccoli. I love these Trader Joe's meals, so put them in the freezer. Okay, so let's move on to perishable items that I got. Um, this is not really anything special, but I wanted to try it out because I never tried it before. But it is the coconut whipped topping. Yannick will love this in his coffee. It's vegan, lactose-free, gluten-free, non-GMO, which is great, so I wanted to go ahead and try it out as a dairy-free option. My absolute favorite kombucha, if I haven't told you enough already, guys, this is my absolute favorite kombucha, the healthy kombucha, pink lady apple. Yannick likes the cayenne cleanse. That one's really good too, but Pink Lady Apple is my OG. Also, some pineapple chunks because I was really feeling like pineapple. It's a great anti-inflammatory fruit, so got some pineapple. We got some basic organic cherry tomatoes. This I can put into my salads. I got a light onion and a red onion. Great for putting into salads. Some avocados. And then I got the Caesar salad mix. I don't know why, I've been craving like Caesar salads lately. So I got the Caesar salad Caesar salad kit. I don't know how it is, but I trust Trader Joe's with my life. If you have not already tried this, you have to try it. If you like Takis, this is the healthy alternative for Takis. Yes. I think they even taste better than Takis. I wish I got another bag, but I wasn't thinking. I haven't had these since my last What I Eat In The Day video. Oh my gosh, it's been like, I feel like months. I haven't been to Trader Joe's that long. It's the seaweed. 
oh it's so good make sure you get the teriyaki one because the teriyaki is different from the regular sea salt i don't mind the sea salt the sea salt is good too but the teriyaki just hits differently but oh we got some doggy treats for Tio, what I was feeding him before, this is the smoked chicken tender dog treats. He just had like two of them and he loves them. I probably shouldn't have fed him that much, but I love my dog, what can I say? I also got some Trader Joe's pickled fermented jalapeno slices. Okay, I have to tell you something about me. I am obsessed with pickled jalapenos. I love pickled jalapenos so much. I literally use it in everything now. I cook my chicken, I put the jalapenos in it. I make a salad, I put jalapenos in it. I love jal pickled jalapenos, it has to be pickled. Another thing that I got, because I'm gonna try it out, is the garlic salt. I am all out of garlic salt and I decided to get this fresh looking garlic salt because it looks healthy. So last but not least, I'm gonna share with you guys some drink stuff that I got. Organic ginger turmeric and herbal tea. Very excited to try this one out. You guys know how much I love teas. I usually drink tea me teas, but I'm gonna give this a whirl. I got some coffee. Um, ooh, it smells so good, guys. Coffee, the Trader Joe's Nicaragua, Sultana del Norte. That's probably not how you say it. The best for last. The Trader Joe's Reserve Chardonnay. This one is Garniros. Garniros, I don't know how to say that but it's a Chardonnay from Napa Valley. I haven't tried this one specifically out, but usually the reserve wines are really good. Um, and then I got a red. This is Paso Robles. I just, I really enjoyed the description in this one. It is juicy blackberry mixed with lavender on the palate with extremely soft, supple tannins. It just sounds inspiring and like delicious, so. That's why I got it. That is all that I have for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give me a like to help my little channel out. And if you haven't already, please make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss any new videos. Thank you again so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye. Well, hello there. Oh, Yannick's favorite flute for the flute. Well, today I, um, <laughs> to my channel next I have you know you know oh you know <laughs> enjoyed this video I shut up this is not to your time John just came home and he sees all the cookies oh, geez. go ahead you can have some you don't have to hide it's you wow you're hiding really well wow that's impressive. You have too much practice.